Hello, my name is Josh Evilsizer, and today I'm going to show you how you can find and manage Chrome add-ons. Let's go. So, first things first, we previously covered this, and the highlights are right here. These are tools added to Chrome apps, like Sheets, Slides, etc., and they perform a function. For example, Yam, or yet another mail, yet another mail merge. So, if you're in Sheets and you go to extensions and add-ons, I'm sorry, uh, extensions, yeah, yeah, another mail merge is right there. So it is added on to a tool that you already use, hence the name. Uh, or here's another example, icons for slides. Um, so I don't draw so good and I want a third party to provide me icons that I can use in my slides and I can come here to add-ons and icons for slides, start that up, and then the neat little search bar comes up over here and gives me uh, the world's oyster of icons that I might ever wanna use. Uh, all right, <clears throat> think of these like you would a car roof rack. Why do I say that? Right, the car is Chrome apps we talked about before. Extensions are like the, perhaps the car stereo and add-ons are like a roof rack. They have very limited capability, it's just, it's, and it's like bolted on, right? It just attaches, and then we use it for, um, you know, one thing basically, put stuff on it, and it's no good without the car. So maybe there's a there's an analogy for you you can you can keep in your mind, uh, but think of them like you would a car roof rack. Limited capabilities. All right. So why do you need an add-on in the first place? Why? What? So what here? Uh, they add a needed capability, and for example, um, I've got uh, Google Sheets. Uh, and I need to send a lot of people, a lot of personalized emails, and I don't wanna go spend money on some other marketing tool, right, that's gonna cost me a lot a month, a lot of dollars a month, but I just need to be able to send uh, some emails. So I can add this add-on, and now I've got that for basically free, uh, or whatever they might charge. I've quickly added a single capability to another Google product that I'm using, very rapidly and with, I guess, minimal looking. Um, I'm not explaining this super well. Let me hit the next bullet here real quick. You solve a problem. Uh, Add-ons and extensions both solve a problem. Uh, I can't PowerPoint so good. So I jump in here and I use these icon finding tools, right? Fishing. Now I got a bunch of great icons for fishing and I don't have to draw and insert them into here. Uh, this calendar I've, I've got for my little time management slide here, found it in icons. Uh, so add-ons just provide a, a slew of just additional handy uh, capabilities to whatever tools you might already be using in Google. Uh, how can you discover the right add-on? Very easy. Search the Google Workspace, Google Workspace Marketplace. So that's workspace.google.com marketplace. And that looks like this. Or search in app. Uh, so you would open Gmail um, and you would click a little plus sign and search when the search bar uh, or the when this opens up. Search Gmail add ons right there. Uh, works in calendar, drive, slides, etc. Just click that plus sign down here. Super easy. All right. Uh, yep. Tap the plus sign and search for. Oh, yeah. So what do you what are you searching, right? So when you open up that search, you want to type in a capability or the name of the tool that you might be looking for. So I'm looking for a mail merge option, and yet another mail merge, of course, one of our first options. Or I could have typed in there yam, and of course it's going to show up. Uh, two ways to look for uh, or to search for the thing you're looking to be able to do. Um, and that's what this is all about. Add-ons and extensions. You're scratching your head because you're trying to do something or you know there's got to be a better way or an easier way. Uh, Add-ons and extensions both provide those additional capabilities. Somebody out there has thought of it, right? Go find them and use that tool. Uh, so search capability or tool name if you know it. Often we don't. We just know we're trying to do something and that's the capability we're searching for. Search Google. Um, always an option, right? Here's the capability I need. Uh, plus the word add-on. And you're like, but Josh, um, or nope, not yet, sorry. Uh, in this case, uh, I've searched icons for slides, and here's the result. So once I 
usually there's a bunch of ads um, that are in the way first, but this showed up right at the very top. Icons for slides, icons add-on. And that's what I was using over here. Uh, so that's how you might search Google for an add-on. Now you're like, Josh, might extensions also show up in your search results? And the answer is yep. That's a good thing because maybe you were actually looking for extension and you didn't even know it. Um, chances are you don't know if what you're trying to do will sh turn up as an extension or an add-on. So just extension and add-on when you do the search. Um, just, just keep it easy. All right, how do you manage them? Also very easy. Uh, open the app that's using the add-on. So in this case, we'll open... Uh, what are we going to talk about here? Let's see. Uh, extensions, add-ons, select add-ons, start or we'll go to we'll go to sheets here. So open the app using the add-on. All right. So we're going to pretend we're we're going to manage the YAM option here. So extensions, add-ons, and manage add-ons. So that's the way to manage your add-ons. We'll click on that. See what happens. Oh, there's the two that I have installed right there, flat icon and yam. And so we can click on the the more menu, uninstall, use, help, report an issue. As you can see, the tool's limited, so the options are limited. Uh, that's one way. We can also go to extensions and actually go to the add-on right there and then launch it. And then from the launch menu sometimes, or from the start menu, or once you start it, uh, there may be other ways or things to manage within the app itself uh, or within the add-on itself there as well. So just two ways, add-ons, manage, and then manage from the three dots menu or actually just launch the add-on itself. Pretty easy. What is left? I think I hit everything here. Uh, or, or finally, the Google Workspace Marketplace settings. So there's the Google Workspace Marketplace and there's the settings button, manage apps. And you'll see what's installed there can be managed. All right, what is left? manage apps and you're like josh apps what <laughs> these, i thought these were add-ons i thought apps was the first thing you talked about then extensions then add-ons wait so apps extensions and add-ons is there a difference is there a difference well let's let's go to the let's go to the judges here apps extensions and add-ons versus apps corporate needs you to find the difference between this picture and this picture and they're the same <laughs> all right enough jokery what's the last thing here what add-on do what add-ons do I recommend and why stay tuned uh, I will have a video or more um, either all of them the top I haven't figured it out yet but we'll share some ideas so you can um, get some more so what and why uh, as always if this was helpful please share like or subscribe or all of the above and please don't forget in the description you will find this outline and ways to contact me thanks for watching have a great day